A clinical in towns in Kisi County have issued a two-week strike notice to compel the employers to address their allowance arrears and other working conditions. According to the interns, they have not received their allowances for more than three months despite them dutifully attending to their task. Ivy Masharia with more details. United shall never be deserted. Our people... Clinical interns in Kisi have decided to tackle their setbacks concerning their pending allowance arrears and other working conditions by issuing a two-week strike notice to their employers. Despite them attending to their duties, they have not been given their allowance for more than three months. General Secretary of Kenya Union of Clinical Officers George Gibure chastises the government for taxing the interns despite their meager earnings while claiming to offer services to Kenyans. He urged Kenyans to keep pushing for change but congratulated President Ruto for his steps in the right direction by sacking cabinet secretaries who were not performing well in their dockets. When you look at the government being comfortable saying they are offering services to Kenyans and they pay them 15000 which is taxable, they only remain with 9000 I think it is a dismay to Kenyan. And this is why Kenyan must continue to push for the change we want. And at least I want to appreciate for the president for asking some of these ministers who have not been assisting him, like in Akumicha, to go home. An intern, Jeremy Nick, lamented on how difficult it was to provide services to Kenyans while barely having enough for basic commodities. He urged the government to release their funds for more efficient services. And we have been here for the past 120 days with no pay. And we are posted here to offer services for the nation. Actually, you cannot be offering services and yet there's nothing in your pocket. You'll be, su you'll be suffering and yet... Imagine I'm, I'm having blood stains with even no soap in my house just to pay for the, for, the, for the basic commodities. So I'm urging the government actually to release our funds. We have been here working, really working, not, not just working, the, the usual working, uh, days like we work we work daily from Monday to Monday no no offs and uh, from Monday to Monday the time is from 8 up to 8 in the evening sometimes even further we do night shifts we do and the pay is very meager by the way Another intern, Lucy Motella, bemoaned on the intern's long working hours and little returns and urged the government to be considerate and to not do the same to the incoming interns. Ivy Masharia, KUTV.